speak up a country? Oh my God, um, uh, Spain. Question from Mr. Spain. Spain. Okay, from Spain, we have the question. Do you prefer to ask for forgiveness or ask for permission? Ah, philosophical question. Ask for forgiveness or ask for permission? I prefer ask forgive me. When we do that, we know we do something bad and we learn of that. So when we please, uh, please uh, ask forgive me, is when we learn of our bad experience. You know, we are humans, we make mistakes. It's the reason to be human. Wow, how wise of you, thank you. Now, Miss Puerto Rico, please speak up a country. USA. A uh, question for Mr. USA. Mr. USA has asked the question, what is the place you would like to visit? What is the place you would like to visit? Well, from my whole life, I've always wanted to visit Paris, but right now the place I want to visit the most is Puerto Rico. Yeah, Puerto Rico is going through a tough time right now, um, and uh, I live in New York, and my presence there will help me see what they are going through right now, and uh, I just want to help. Thank you, Miss Puerto Rico. It's so touching. Thank you. Wow. Miss Ethiopia, please pick up a country for a question. Canada. A question from Mr. Canada. A question from Canada. What was your feeling when you appear for the first time on stage and all the atmosphere in front of the camera tonight? Hmm? Uh, I was so excited, but I uh, too, uh, I'm so happy because I'm here to present my country, my lovely and my uh, sweet country. So I was so happy and I was so excited to present my country. This is my feeling. Were you more stressed or happy? Oh, I'm so happy because, uh, because I know myself, I'm so strong woman, uh, so I'm so happy uh, to deserve it. Happy answer of a happy girl. Thank you. Miss Romani, your country. Hello, good evening everyone, and I want to say that today is the national day of Romania, so la mulțian Romania, and happy birthday Romania. I love you, my team. Okay, you still have the reels, please pick up a country. I pick Peru. A question from Mr. Peru. Okay, from Peru. What do you think about violence towards women? Oh, that's a tough one. What do you think about violence towards women? Well, thank you for your question, Mr. Peru. I don't know where you are. Um, yes, discrimination, abuse, and violence against women, but not women, and children, and also teenagers, are like a right, a human right, that is a violation right now, is violated. A man, we must teach men to respect women. You can hit a woman, you need to respect them, because the woman, the woman born you, it's your mother. The woman that teach you the first, the alphabet and all the things are that teacher. The woman that was playing with you is your sister. The woman that you love, it's your wife. The woman that probably when you'll die will absorb you, it's Mother Earth, and you need to respect that. Uh, be a queen without scars. Be a queen without scars. All women need that, and respect for all women. You're a great speaker. You're a great speaker, Miss Romania. Thank you. That's right. It was wonderful. Representing women. Oh, yeah. Miss Korea, your country. Netherlands. Question from Mr. Netherlands. Okay, from Mr. Netherlands. What would you do with one million dollars? Ah, what would you do with one, with one million dollars? Hey. Thank you for your question. Well, if I had one million dollars, I would like to build a school because it's one of my advocacies to help children who are not getting the enough basic education to do so. So if I had one million dollars, I would build a school so every children can help and make the, the future a brighter place. Thank you. Thank you, Miss Korea. Very noble of you. 
Thank you so much for your answer. Thank you so much, ladies. Those were beautiful answers.